Alex uh, Rapacoli out of sixth position. Then we have actually Don McRae, and alongside him will be Glenn Harrop. Thanks, Rob, back in ninth position today, Bailey, with uh, Chucky Habishon starting alongside him. Then you go back to uh, Jeff Douche and uh, Jane McCoon out of um, 11th and 12th position. Paddy Powell out of 13th uh, with Corey Anderson alongside him. Then we go back to Mike uh, Michalis in uh, position 15 with Stuart Reed alongside him. Then we go back to uh, Ian Burkle out of position 17 and Harry Bowers alongside him. And then it's Dominic Morris and Ashley Greer. Next row back, it's uh, Kelly Flynn out of number 21 with Jules Van Nightkirk alongside her and Nigel Smith and uh, Skippy Pasco out of 23rd and 24th. Just behind them, it's Hugh Paris and Dave Williams uh, and then it's Ben Van Der Werf and uh, Dave Madraki out of positions 27th and 28th. Kent Dalziel starts out of 29, Dale, Dale Kiley alongside him and then out of 31st positions, Roger Johnson with Danny Clark alongside him. Then we go back to Marco Tang and Gordon Murray out of 33 and 34, then at 35, and we're just, I think we're just about ready to get underway, so uh, 35 is Carl Driver, Dean Jones, then Trask, 38, Tyler, 39, 40, Mark Barlow, last man running, Roy Campbell. So there we go, that's the field, so let's have a look off of pole positions, Greg Larson, and uh, alongside him in a little forward laser, it looks like it's Jordan Stickings. So we're just waiting for notification of uh, yep five second board is just about ready to come out and because it's a handicap start it's going to be done on flag so there's your first group gone that's the first group of, uh, and that includes Chucky Habishon who gets a flying start there and just gets himself right through the field up
else on Dan, so I get Dan as a hawk who hit me. Inside goes the MR2. Just so many passes. Oh, we've got somebody off the air now. The hairpin who's that couldn't pick it up. Silver looks like one of the Integra. Uh, the latest one that looks like a little bit to me. The silver one. They look different on the cameras. It's a little bit I can't tell you what. The worst part about it is you can't pick up the numbers. That's the hardest. <laughs> so, yeah, we uh, might have to get bigger numbers on that to do this job. Yes. through 
enjoying watching their car out the front. Martini colours this year, which I think is fantastic. I'm a huge fan of the, uh, what was it last year, like, the yeah. they moved to the Martini, which is a classic race car for me, and just improved their car looks. And I saw it for the first time when I was there three years ago, and so I thought, oh, I'm never going to shake your hand to this thing. I've got a lot of it. That's Casey there, it's Casey there, quickly.
as they go through the port, uh, the Porsche Dipper. He's a little bit further back. And there's a couple of good battle groups going on there. So, uh, so Nigel, are you gonna, how much are you running? Are you going to do this season? Are you going to have a good in most of it? I reckon this year, this year we've had a go to the sheet. We've had a couple of years we've had a car each, but this year we're sharing a Matthew Dixie for Scooter Valley car, so he's going to be out there in the next year to go to car. It's amazing.
dead right. The uh, um, start of the circuit racing will do you around. He's a great rider in Africa. Um, it, it teaches you about apex and corners and that sort of thing. Like early apex and late apex is an unknown rallying. You've really got to be a late apex. So um, it is certainly a, a good way to start. And uh, he'll enjoy it. He certainly will. Play with, you know, can't wait to do the full talk. Don't be done with TK Cups. So we won't stop him. Yeah, really enjoy it. For sure, thank you, Dave. Yeah. Hey, thanks very much, Nigel. Thank great, you. great talking to you. We'll uh, uh, we wish you all the best for the coming season. And, uh, yeah, Matthew in his rallying career. So, um, here we go. We've got to... Uh, so we've just got uh, what's happening out on track at the moment. And uh, we're looking at uh, Dominic Morris. He's got himself in the second, fourth position there. James McCoom still sitting in the second position. Ken Dalziel now up at third. And uh, closing fast at uh, 14.2 seconds down. We just had a word of another driver change. The slim car is the partner. That was Rachel Heron. He's a first one, which had a weird confused with Kelly because I knew that she was a good driver. And
just trying to pick up where they are. Yeah, no, New Zealand is moving up with New Zealand flag on the uh, bonnet of that car. Uh, saw Neil Rose in the pit. He's pretty happy to see his car going so well. Uh, and yeah, get, get, get to get to the now. Okay, well, 
Well, the hay will go back to the great race. So if you get, that's the thing I do love about the handicap racing. It does really shake things up. You know, and uh, the next one's going to be even more interesting um, because you've got some uh, real hard charges in the next one. Yeah, no, I'm really disappointed actually after the first race of how much damage we saw. And I've got to go through the pits and uh, as the series organiser getting uh, pulled across quite a bit. Uh, I have to definitely say I'm not on driver standards. Uh, I walked away from that committee after I started it and ran it for a year. Um, <laughs> decided it was the best thing to walk away from that I got, yep. so my father's on that now. Yep. Uh, he took quite a hit actually in the first race, so that'll be looked into. Uh, stoved in the rear quarter. Uh, but yeah, just a little bit too, well, not too bad contact, but a fair bit of a few rubs and stuff like that, which uh, is just not acceptable in 2K Cups. No, so they'll no. get a bit of a talking to come uh, the sausage prize coming. Okay, well, we're now going to have a, uh, a half hour break. We're going to go away and. Um, oh, are we having a break now? Yeah, we're having a break because the supercars are out next. Oh, and well, oh, Gordon told me a 2K Cup was next. Well, hang on, according to my pre-hosh. We'll go and check where we're, we're going. We'll go and check with race control. We'll be back with you shortly.